TGM Production presents. Just before the podcast begins, I'd just like to announce that Sadly Poddlebox, which is my second podcast over my third channel on YouTube, if you're watching this on YouTube, has sadly been cancelled because I, it just didn't really work for what I needed it to do anymore. So I'm sad to announce that. But let's get in to the podcast. Hello everyone and welcome to a new episode of Doctor Who Discussion! Woo! Now today is a brand new episode and we're going to look at the news. We're going back to what we used to do on the Doctor Who Discussion. So I'm just bringing up the news articles so we can see what, uh, see what's what over in the world of Doctor Who. See what news articles people are trying to protect. People are saying who the Doctor is this time round. We'll find out. So let me just uh, let me set this up now. Uh, now I've got a good feeling that it's going to be stuff like uh, who is the new um, who is the next Doctor? And be like something like oh, this person's been confirmed as the next Doctor, which is sort of stuff I really don't like, and a lot of YouTubers and a lot of Fans don't like it when the media uh, are doing stuff. Oh, let me just make sure this article are doing stuff like that. Uh, I'm not a fan of, of that either. So let's oh, let's get into it. Uh, let's begin. Right. So uh, you're not going to be able to see on the screen just yet. I'm going to try and scroll until I find an article I want to talk about. Then uh, then we'll talk about it so here's a little glimpse that's the stuff you'll see if you watch this on youtube um now let's go ah here's here's an interesting article for uh, all the american viewers of um doctor who uh this is going to be an interesting article let me just put it in the big screen oh sorry about this guys let me just oh let me just oh sorry Sorry about this, guys. We've got a slight issue over on the video version of the podcast. Now, what it's talked about, uh, I'll just give you a brief run whilst I'm trying to fix my issue because I still want to talk through this. Is we're talking about uh, how they're going to premiere one of the lost stories in uh, the US on BBC America. Which is a little bit of a different channel to the BBC over here because they've got one got adverts uh, and two, uh, really funnily, uh, two show shows that aren't available in the UK just yet. So it's like BBC shows, but being made by BBC America, which like uh, which is a bit of a rat. Let's get into it. So it says Ace MC Network is unleashing a Tornado, tornado of new programming of the new genre horror content in 2021 and beyond their brands, including BBC America's debut of the animated Doctor Who Fury, Fury from the Deep. Now, I think this is a quite a good article. Uh, uh, well, not a good article. It's a good thing that the BBC are doing. I am very very happy that the 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 producing it for tv even if it's not for us here which we could just put on the bbc player but they're all on brit box but i'm quite glad that in america they get you're getting a chance to watch it on a national telly um now a lot of it's there's not a lot of who news apart from the uh apart from uh the metro do i trust the metro that's a story for a completely different day. Now, I'll just read this to you because there's not a lot to show you. Because uh, it's a metro, so there's a lot of uh, adverts. But they're just saying that Bill uh, wants to you know, wants to return into Doctor Who. Whether that's audio or not, 
which in my opinion is very exciting i'm quite excited for that uh and also i just want to say if you're watching this on youtube and you're listening to it uh it is in a little different format one you can hear it from both years this time the man who solved that issue and second of all we've had a little bit at the beginning which uh you will have already heard which is uh tj productions which is uh what i've called my new clips channel my shorts channel where it, oh, i've got a bit of hair on my desk come on come and get off the desk right which is a clips channel i've got where i put clips on from all my channels and i now put fun from the beginning for it and funnily enough it's it's it just makes this seem professional because big finish do big finish audio big finish presents i along with the trailer i stalk tarot avengers and uh big finish is massive in the audio world which i prefer the visual to audio but doctor who um audios are really good now we're onto a very good website here we're on Doctor Who TV, which is very respectable in my eyes, and we're talking about. Do, 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 do. Oh, I'm a bit, I'm a little bit too big. Talking about. Oh, it's gonna. It, we're talking about the new Doctor Who uh, video game for mobile, which sees Sally Sparrow from Blink uh, returning, which is going to be quite, quite exciting. Sally Sparrow returning. Now we're not going to play the trailer, um, because I don't want to. But but it says it says here, which if you're watching this on YouTube, you'll see that I've highlighted the key information. Digital Entertainment Studio May Theory, in partnership with the BBC Studio, is excited to reveal the cryptic f found phone adventure game Doctor Who: The Lonely Assassin will launch on. March 10th, 2021, for iOS and Android mobile devices and Steam, so you'll be able to play it on your uh, computer. Uh, so I'm just highlighting the important information that I'm going to read out. Uh, oh, it says, Following the encoding of the Tenth Doctor's Weeping Angels were trapped in the basement. Oh, no devices safe. It, it's that word, no devices are safe, makes this game more... Uh, more like the type of game that I would want to buy. Now it's two ninety nine at the moment, I think, for pre orders, which is a good price. Um, for it, and I'm quite excited for it. Now we're going down to some of the final new that because because there's not a lot. So these episodes aren't like usual one hour long podcast. It's like a short podcast, depending on what news we get because we're discussing the news. And it's only an hour when I have guests on. So I did Adam Martin for one episode. I do want more YouTubers and people from Doctor Who to actually come on to interview. So if the Who New podcast uh, knows how they can help me, please help me Who New podcast. Because uh, Who New podcast is a big podcast in the Doctor Who universe, the Doctor Who fandom, uh, the Whovian community, creators, creators wise, where they get different people on. And I want to know how, because I've loved having Adam Martin on there on here so i want more guests on here and then i can do it more visual like now on the youtube channel um uh jody whitaker to reunite with bill as he as bill drops hints which is pearl mackie pearl mackie should come back in the audios um a lot of it's like who, who, who do they want to become the next doctor and i mean i made a vi i've made several videos on that um we're getting some some more audios from Big Finish, which um, I'm quite, quite looking forward to. And yeah, um, here's something I do want to say, uh, that Joe Martin, who is a Fugitive Doctor, really do want to come back in Series 13. Whether whether he's not building up for a spin-off that a lot of people are talking about, especially uh, Confused Adipose, that I did borrow his thumbnail for in two of my videos, and I'm really sorry if you look, I'm really appreciated. And I borrowed them, and I just, I just wanted to shout out Confused Adipose because Confused Adipose is a brilliant YouTuber, thumbnail wise, brilliant content wise, fantastic, up there with the greatest YouTubers of all time. We've got Ace Creeper, we've got Crispy Pro, we've got Confused Adipose, we've got the main protagonist, and we've got Adam Martin. Not, not necessarily in that order, but they're the, they're the key ones that I want to. 
to mention on the podcast because a uh, main protagonist featured on a, another podcast recently brilliant interview um really insightful about how she began in doctor who crispy pro is one of the greatest australian youtubers ace creeper is probably the biggest youtuber i think on youtube i think i'm not even sure and adam martin this is fantastic content not just about doctor who but his doctor who content is amazing so is his podcast but we're going off track we talked about who tumors but sylvester mccoy uh i reckon sylvester mccoy will and should appear in the 60th anniversary i'm just gonna put that out there sylvester mccoy and colin baker should return paul mcgann should return as well but paul mcgann is happy in, in the audio world so Will will we will we want him back? Will we want him back? Who knows? So now we're opening up a new segment called Big Finish, where Finish I'm go- I'm googling it at the same time. Where I look at the latest Big Finish covers for Doctor Who, uh, Big Finish, Doctor Who covers, where we look at the Doctor Who covers and we say, uh, do we like the look of it or or what are our thoughts on it? So. Uh, I've got a few lined up. I'm going to get a few lined up. Uh, oh no, we'll, we'll just look at them on Google as we go. So, here we go. If you're watching this on uh, YouTube, you'll be able to see. But if you listen to it, I will describe it for you. So, first of all, uh, as you can see, we have Doctor Who, a full cast audio drama, Paul McGann, uh, and, and the other in The Eighth Doctor's Time War 2. And it's a really good cover because it's the good feature of the Daleks uh, coming out of the space. And the colours are quite good. Now, there is going to be a video on my channel on Zap's uh, covers. We will be doing a more new uh, segment in the podcast for all your listeners and for the different bits and bobs as we go through. But what I do want to talk about, uh, really, really interestingly, there's a new series coming to the Tom Mason YouTube channel where I try and recreate big finish covers or just covers of like uh, Johnny Whittaker's like stance cover but with different actors. Do so what Ace Creeper does at the moment. Uh, and I'm just going to just do this because I really like doing the fade trick. No, I can't fade myself in. Okay. Can't. Okay. So, um, let's, let's just... so, yeah. So, I'm really looking forward to doing. I really love the fade on here. On YouTube, uh, I'm really uh, excited and looking forward to share you that series when it comes, which will come soon. Uh, Doctor Who is fantastic. I love it. This is why I've been doing a lot more videos on the channel. This was the third video today. Uh, I'm trying to build this channel up more because I love Doctor Who. There'll be another episode of my dream spin-offs coming soon. We we'll hope you enjoyed this podcast. If you have any feedback of how I can improve the podcast visually and audioly visually and in audio, please leave your thoughts in the comment section down below. I hope you have enjoyed listening to this video. If you've listened to it on Apple Podcasts, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Google Podcasts, and Amazon Music Podcasts, and hopefully you've enjoyed it if you watched it over on the Tom Mason YouTube channel. For you guys, thank you guys for watching. Time on, time out. Bye! Hope you enjoyed!